Hello again everybody. I'd like to uh, thank the new subscribers that I have that are following along on this build. As I mentioned last night, I had uh, placed the initial couple of number 540 uh, drilled and tapped holes very close to an eighth inch in because this is quarter inch steel at the bottom of the mud ring. I just took the fire uh, the uh, propane burner assembly out and uh, so that you could see where these are placed. I got the, the back ones done first and just fine and as I mentioned yesterday the first couple of attempts uh, when I used my spring-loaded center punch um, you can see where these uh, the first couple holes were. I tried moving it around a little bit and this was just going to be way too close to the edge for a proper hole so I scribed a line here at an eighth inch in, and then I ended up drilling those extra holes in the in the angle iron that constitutes the um, bottom of the or the edges of the gas burner, the loco parts gas burner. So got all four of the holes drilled and tapped, and I thought I'd want to show you that in a little bit more detail tonight. I'm going to flip this over, and I decided I didn't get the firebox door mounted yet. I'm going to grind the weld down just a little bit so it's a little bit flatter so I get a little bit more flush fit with the um, with the actual firebox door. So I think tonight I'll just flip it over and then tomorrow evening grind down the welds just a teeny bit. Maybe just even use my uh, a small grinding stone in my Dremel. Uh, either that or that. I do have an angle grinder I could touch on there and just get it a little bit flatter before I drill and tap the holes. There's no sense rushing it. Um, so thanks for watching and I'll keep you posted.